hello everybody hello everyone I hope you are all fine today we are going to learn our new lesson Robinson Crusoe discovers a footprint from unit number three right this lesson is taken by book Robinson Crusoe and it is written by Daniel Defoe in which he discovers footprint okay students let's see this Robinson Crusoe he was a man who loves to do sea voyage and he loves to go on the long journey in the sea one day when he was on the journey in the sea his ship was wrecked into the storm and he was left behind the island okay and there he had spent 20 years of his life students and when he was there on the island alone what are the difficulties he faced and how he managed to live there 28 years is the story right this is the uh, book from Robinson Crusoe is taken means this is the small portion is taken by actually the book of Robinson Crusoe in the story Robinson discovered a footprint it is actually uh, he didn't know whose footprint, footprint was that right so let's see how he managed to live on the island and what are the worries over there right students so look at the picture here here the man that uh, look at that man who lived on the island from so long ago right how he was bearded and what kind of things in his hands are there okay students so let's see the actual lesson okay look at that footprint also here okay so actual lesson is here Robinson Crusoe ship had been destroyed by the sea he had been alone for many years and long for company one day he discovers a footprint on the sand let's find out what he did then okay so first of all before starting our lesson we will see the keywords from the text right let's see look at that keywords the first word is destroyed destroyed means ruin right then long means wished for then discovers it means finds out another amazed means surprise seashore means sure sure means back of the sea hill back part of the human foot right frightened afraid castle okay castle it means fort like okay then chase means ran after and savages new word is there savages mean wild people wondered means went here and there like roaming right then realize means felt fearful it means afraid then look at that next word comforted mean relaxed investigate mean examine then forward it means ahead frightened maybe you know that afraid examine means look carefully inhabited means with the people or animals living there right students so these are the words you have to uh, write down in your notebook okay then we will move towards our actual lesson look at that lines once again a Robinson Crusoe ship had been destroyed by the sea means because of storm or stormy weather his ship was destroyed or wreck in the rocks right then look at that he had been alone for many years I told you before that he was on that island from last 28 years right and long long means wished for a company he wished for a company he was as alone is there therefore he wished for a company so one day he discovered a footprint on the sand and in between he discovered he found suddenly a footprint on the land right let's find out what he did then is he worried or is he frightened right students let's see what happened look at that first para one day when I was going towards my boat I was surprised to see the footprint of a man on the sand 
look at that while roaming here and there or suffering on the beach or on the island robinson found that there is a footprint and he was great su surprise so i stood amazed and he was surprised surprise it means amazed so i listen i look around me i could neither hear nor see anything so when he saw that footprint he was surprised and looked here and there he tried to listen out is there anybody or not right i could neither hear nor see anything but he didn't found anything there okay so i went up higher to look down i went up shore and down the shore but it was no good i could find no other footprint but that one and lo what happened when he found he want to investigate and therefore robinson went up higher and down here and there he went to the shore and down to the shore but there was a not any footprint rather than that only footprint right okay i went to it again to see if there were any more footprints and tell if it had been my imagination and as he saw that only a single footprint he was very eager to find out is there any else means is there anything else means another footprints are there and therefore he suddenly start investigating and then he found that there is a nothing means no more footprints here and they are all on the shore but i was not mistaken for there was exactly the footprint of foot i was not mistaken for there was exactly the print of foot toes heel every part of a foot but robinson was sure i was not mistaken means he was sure because there was exactly the footprint and foot uh, it has a toes and heel every part of a foot i could not imagine how it came there and he could not understand how it came there who that uh, man is be like that so i stayed a long time thinking but became more and more confused and then he started thinking who is that and then after he became where more and more confused because he didn't get that answer of his questions means who's that footprint was right okay look at that next page at last i return home at last i return home very frightened looking behind me after every two or three steps mistaking every bush and tree to be a man means when he was trying to return to his home means as he was frightened he want to go back early to his home back right so while going back to his home he was looking behind every after two or three steps because he was very frightened and mistaking every bush and tree or to be a man and he was found that uh, is that any man is behind him like that and therefore he was worried and so much of frightened like uh, okay when i came to my cave which i called my castle look at that uh, when he came to his cave uh, at that time on the beach or on the island there were no there were no houses so he lived in a cave right so he called that cave as a castle you know that castle means fort okay so i ran inside it as if i was being chased and immediately hurriedly he ran himself and he has to be go inside within his cave early because he found that is that anybody chasing him like that and therefore i don't remember whether i used the ladder or went in by the hole in the eagerness let's see what happened in the next but first of all we will see this line i do not remember whether i used the ladder or went in by the hole in the rock which i called a door means he did not remember how he enter in the house means is cave he ran he ran again and again very fast and hurriedly because he was frightened i ran for cover faster than any animal couldn't run and therefore 
he ran as like a wild animal like a deer it's very fast okay so faster and faster he has to go at his house means at his cave so i did not sleep that night the more i thought about what i had seen the more afraid i became and he thought himself that he thought again and again and he was getting more afraid because as he thought more he afraids more right like that so i thought it could be one of the savages of the mainland who had wandered out of out to the sea in a small boat and then finally he went on to the decision that it could be the savage savage means it is a wild man like okay so maybe they were wild man and they may came to the sea shore in a small boat like that he thought about that footprint luckily i was not on shore that time luckily i was not on shore at that time but what if had seen my boat and then he talk himself that oh i am so much lucky if i was there they may be kill me like that and therefore he found himself very lucky if he had seen the boat he would have realized that someone lived on the island and would soon return with others to kill me and eat me right see then he supposed to be that if that wild man would uh, see my boat then they will realize that there will be someone on the island and maybe they would return again to kill me and eat me these things are all came in the mind of robinson okay students so and so i lay fearful for many days and prayed for the protection and therefore robinson uh, stay at home as a fear in a fearful condition for many days and then he prayed for protection in doing so i was much comforted and began going out to investigate and then after after a few days he found himself very comfort means relax and then he went out to the cave for investigation purpose investigation means to examine who's that footprint was all right students so but when but even now uh, as i went forward i looked behind me frequently means he was worried and frightened too as he walked forward he went forward he looked behind himself frequently is there anybody or not right and therefore because i was still was very frightened and the, why he was looking behind frequently because he was frightened right then however as i went about for and then as i went about for two or three days and saw nothing i became little bolder means what then he went at that footprint place nearly two to three days okay and he watched that footprint again and again and then only he became little bolder okay then i decided to go down to the seashore again and examine the footprint once more and again he decided to go there and examine the footprint i decided to measure it with my own footwork and then he want to compare that footprint is that um, his own or is that anybody others right so he went there to measure that footprint with his own foot mark right and i came closer to the footprint and when he came closer to the footprint he realized that it could not be his own footprint right because i had not come to this part of the beach since a long time it means what when he compare both the footprints he means his own and that uh, on the seashore then he realized that that footprints could not be match okay and therefore he thought himself that how it could be match because i wasn't came there before long time right secondly as i place my foot alongside that footprint it seemed larger than my own and he again discovers that the footprint before 
was little larger little big footprint right than its own my fear return and then what happened then he really again frightened okay i went home again believing that there was a someone there the island was inhabited it means what again he became frightened as he uh, discovered that there was something somebody may be on the island and therefore the last sentence is the island was inhabited means any human beings or animal may be there on the island like that and again he found a uh, frightened very much okay students so this is the end of the lesson here and robinson as he wished for company he found a footprint on the shore and because of the footprint he was worried and frightened too okay students i hope uh, you would understand it better thank you take care